What's up guys? I'm here with my wife and we're here in downtown Redlands and we're going to be trying Dot Island today and also we're going to be stopping by Martha Green's to check out their desserts. I saved a lot of calories for this moment. I fasted all day and so I'm ready to eat some desserts. Are you ready? Yes! and banana cream. She said white cake um, with chocolate cake, banana cream layer, a fudge layer, and banana cream layer. That sounds good. Oh, Is there cake, all the cakes there? Red velvet. Chocolate fudge cake, chocolate raspberry. Um, ganache cake. Look at all these Victorian. cakes they have here. Raspberry Your Victorian lemon cake, cake, lemon cake, lemon orange cake bliss cake, so carrot cake, lemon red velvet, so red good. velvet. Man, this place is awesome. This is one of the hidden gems of Redlands for sure. Cheesecake. They even have a keto cheesecake. Oh wow. And they have keto cupcakes. It's awesome. Pumpkin cheesecake. Tiramisu. I like tiramisu a lot. They have brownies, apricot bars, lemon bar. Dang. I love lemon bars. The cake of the month is the chocolate banana. Oh, so you get to choose your own yeah. cakes. That's the one like, I want to try. Just one slice. The chocolate that's, banana. That's really cool. So you don't have to buy a whole cake. You can just buy one slice. You don't feel as guilty about eating a whole cake yourself. What we got for now is the s'more cookie. We got the caramel apple cream cheese bar and the lemon bar. I love lemon bars. My husband picked this one, the caramel apple cream cheese bar, but I love lemon bars. So we're gonna try them right now. I'm excited. I know Martha Greens has so many yummy baked goods. Yummy, yummy baked goods. We still have yet to eat there um, in the restaurant, right babe? We've never done that. But I have been to the bakery before and I know I love what I've tried over there. All right, babe, so which one are we gonna have first? Um, you pick. Let's try a piece of the s'more cookie first. Okay. Ooh, this looks nice and gooey. Dang, take a bite and see what you think. Mmm. Does it taste like a s'more? Mmm. I know it tastes mostly chocolate. I think it's because I didn't get the middle that much yet. Oh, the marshmallow? But what I like about it is it's nice and gooey and it's pretty soft. I don't like cookies that are really hard. I like softer, gooey cookies. Yummy, yummy. What is it from rating it from 0 to 10? 
Zero being the worst. I can be really picky. I give it like a nine. An Ooh, eight or a nine. Wow. It's really up there. Try the the apple one. Oh yeah, that's the one you wanted, huh babe? Yeah, try that one. Ooh, look at that. It looks like an apple pie on the side. Caramel apple cream cheese bar. We should have got forks. <laughs> Alright, go for it. Mmm, yummy. That one's good too? Mm-hmm. What's your rating on this one? Mmm, I don't know. Evan? It's up there. I give it like an 8 too. So this last one I'm going to try is the lemon bar. <laughs> Dang, it's all like creamy, gooey. I know. I'm going to go in cheese ball and get a fork real quick. Mmm, yummy. Not bad? What's, I love lemon. What's your rating? Alright guys, so I just want you to know that I fasted all morning for this. I haven't eaten. It's like 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And so I can have enough calories to try these desserts. Let's try the small one first. Smart cookie. It's pretty good. I give it like an 8. 8 out of 10. The marshmallow is really gooey. And it gives it that good marshmallowy taste. And the cookie's chocolate. It's a solid cookie right there. Let's try this apple one here. Mmm. Mmm. That tastes like apple pie. Straight up. It's really gooey. And it's chilled. That's what I like. You gotta eat it fresh. Like right when you buy it, eat it. It's chill. Mmm, it's good. Let's try this lemon one. I don't want it to fall out. Mmm. It's good too. They're chilled. I don't know, the fact that it's cold makes it taste a lot better, but it's really good regardless. Mmm, it's good on a hot day. Yeah, if you really want to get the island feel, you can come out here and eat, take off your shoes, <laughs> and put your feet in the sand. Wow, it really gives the island feel in here with the music, and then just like the colors. It's so cute in here. Wow, this might be my new favorite place in Redlands. Such a nice website they have. Dot Island. It's nice, beautiful colors. Forget about TSA canceled flights and long layovers. Your Caribbean experience is just moments away. Wow, so my wife is vegetarian, so they just offered her a bunch of vegetarian options. Well, there's a small little vegetarian section right here, actually. Wow, now that looks good. 
You got the mushroom portobello with sweet plantains and I got the salty and sweet plantains with red beans and rice and the chicken. Alright babe, so what would you think about Dot Island? Honest opinion. <laughs> I thought the environment was awesome. I thought it was so cute. The setup, the music, everything. Um, when they greeted us, they lit a little candle in the middle of the table. It, it was really cute. It was nice. I'm a vegetarian and for my honest opinion, just for me, um, I didn't like what I ordered. <laughs> To be honest, I got the portobello mushroom with the side of the red beans and rice and the sweet plantain. It it was it was okay, but it, it had like a bunch of bell peppers. I do not like bell peppers. Um, I thought the mushrooms were kind of salty, but they were really flavorful. Um, it was just cute. The service was awesome. Really great waiter. He was really nice. Uh, just for me. I thought the vegetarian options were kind of scarce. You can get a bunch of sides if you would like. I don't like only just vegetables. Um, there was a lot of salad options. It was cute and nice, but it, uh, I don't know. Maybe what I ordered, maybe I should have got something else. It was okay. And for me, I enjoyed every second of it. I liked the atmosphere. Uh, the plantains were good, both the salty and the sweet. Very good food. I'll go back for sure. I like the rice. I liked everything about it. So I guess it's just preference. So if you go, just remember, you might not like it. You might like it. Depends on your taste buds. And what you order. It could have been what I ordered. And it could have been what she ordered, but I liked it. It was so, nice though. Really good service. So I give it like a 8.7 out of 10. What about you? And that's environment and food. No, I don't want to rate it. You don't want to rate it? Mm -hmm. Okay, so she's not going to rate it.